Turkey has decided to shut down its embassy in Yemen and evacuate its staff because of the worsening situation in the capital Sana'a due to intensified clashes between Shiite militia and Sunni opposition groups. The Turkish embassy in Sana'a planned to suspend its operations on late February 15 after securing the safe return of Turkish citizens in Yemen. Ambassador Fazıl Korman and other diplomats were expected to return to Turkey late yesterday after the completion of necessary procedures. Many Western countries, including the United States, France and Britain, as well as Saudi Arabia, closed their diplomatic missions in the capital because of the worsening situation last week. The Turkish foreign minister issued February 14 a new travel warning to Yemen for Turkish citizens and called on them to immediately leave the country. Hundreds of Turkish citizens have already left Yemen on scheduled flights by Turkish airlines. The United States, France, Germany, Italy, Britain and the Netherlands have also closed their embassies and withdrawn staff because of security fears, the agents France Press reported. Spain said it was temporarily suspending embassy activity in Yemen in light of the current situation of insecurity and instability in Sana'a. The embassy had advised all Spanish citizens to temporarily leave Yemen, the foreign ministry said. The Shiite group that has taken control of the capital, the Houthis, said Western powers had no reason to shut their embassies, insisting that security was solid in the capital. Tehran also criticized the hasty action of closing the embassies, insisting the Houthis were fighting corruption and terrorism.